the small car doesn't know his lane is ending or isn't smart enough to speed up or slow down. The blue car is dramatic and doesn't pay attention long enough to calm down. They swerve way too hard and lose control. Good situational awareness on the camera's part. Some texters would have just plowed into that truck. I like how the pickup truck noped out. The semi-truck driver claimed a steer tire locked up, but I guess he was distracted by something. Luckily, there were no injuries reported, and it was cleaned up in two hours. Literally all he had to do was look and pay attention, and that's like rules number one and two of driving. On top of that, he flipped off the camera as if the camera did something wrong. If the guy didn't slap his cargo and say, that ain't going nowhere before he started driving, everyone knows you gotta do that at least once. Yep, that's Katie for ya. The big trucks think that they can do whatever they want. The source is, is that I live in Houston, so I would know. The camera, in my opinion, would be at fault as he completely ignored the red light in a measly attempt to block the other driver from merging and didn't slow down at all. There was literally a whole mergeable space right behind the escape driver for Mr. Pickup. But I guess that would have hurt his ego if he had to do that. Always avoid riding next to truck tires is excellent advice. Half of life is just not getting into a bad situation in the first place. He could have taken the lane at any time, but chooses the moment someone comes up alongside to do it. Every time I see a wheel come off, I think about this old Kenny Rogers song from the 70s that I'm not singing, but the lyrics go, You picked a fine time to leave me, loose wheel. The kid rolls out into the street as the camera approaches the driveway. Thankfully, the parents notice and help prevent the child from going further into the road. An early 2000s Corolla in San Bernardino? Yeah, make sure you have uninsured motorist coverage. He pulled the, I'm just gonna do it, good luck everyone else card. So it's good old Houston drivers for ya.
It looks like the left lane was closed the whole time, but two cones got knocked over at the beginning, and the lane close sign was way too far to the right, so it was an easy mistake to go end up on the wrong side of the cones. Funny how it's always cars that already have damage on them from previous accidents. We need to get bad drivers off the road already. Driving is a privilege, not a right. Unless this was a planned funeral procession, which I don't think it is, I don't understand why they can't wait at the light. You'll catch up or meet them at the location. I've known many writers for years, so I'm not speaking as an outside four-wheeler. Did he wake up on the wrong side of the bed or something? I mean, geez louise, the dude's angry at traffic on a road. How ridiculous is that? Thank you for watching. Please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing because it really helps me. If you'd like me to feature one of your clips, please email it to originaldsdstv2 at gmail.com.